According to the ACHA and CHA, 89% of college students are sexually active, so this might not be a realistic uh, competitive measure for some. And vaccinations, like I talked about, the HPV vaccination, that's something you can get before the infection, and they also offer the vaccination for hepatitis B. And getting tested. Getting tested is very important because that's the only way you find out for sure, like I was talking about in HIV. Um, you don't know for sure until you get tested, so getting tested regularly for every new sexual partner once a year is good. And the use of condoms. Condoms are the only preventative the only contraceptive measure that also protects you from STIs. And reducing the number of sexual partners is also very important because what I've only had one partner isn't an excuse for someone because that person could have also had many partners and someone around there could have had HIV or other than STIs. So some things we covered today is that um, STIs have permanent and detrimental effects, and we went over some of the most common sexually transmitted infections amongst young adults, and we just went over some preventative measures. And that's all. Okay, so, so conclusively, making the best decision for your health is by is influenced by the educated on STIs and knowing about preventative measures.